I don't know what it is, man. Just ever since Alyssa broke up with me, I haven't been seen. Dude, didn't you say you left her like a week into dating? You guys were hardly together. Yeah, but I mean, like, that's just it. You know, what happened to the romance in relationships? Like, I'm tired of these sluts who just want sex. <laughs> who the hell are you? You're in your sexual prime at a university populated by girls who only want yeah. to have sex. And you're complaining. Well, it just doesn't do it for me anymore, you know? Like, alright, so last night, I'm watching TV, and I'm flipping through the channels, because I'm tired of Sports Center, and there's this movie on. And I'm enjoying it, but I'm, like, really enjoying it. Factor Slots 9, right? Yeah, I caught that too. Pinnacle of American cinema. No, that, that wasn't it. What, worse than Backdoor Sluts 9? What was it, DP? No. Animals? No. Tentacles? No! Asians? No. And then what was it? <sighs> when Harry met Sally. When oh. Harry met Slutty? I'm sorry, I'm not familiar with no, that. No, no, when Harry met Sally. It's a Billy Crystal movie. And I got to that scene at the end when they're at the New Year's Eve party, and he's giving that speech. I love... Yeah. That I can still smell your perfume on my clothes at the end of the day. Yeah, that's it, but that's not I the point. I love that you're the last person I want to talk to before I go to bed at night. And that's not just because I'm lonely. But yes, God did stop. That's it. Why do you have the entire thing memorized? You know what? That's not the point. The point is, that speech gave me a semi. And it just really freaks me out because I think the only thing that turns me on anymore is love. I'm in love with love. I can only get turned on by romance. So you're saying your new fetish is true love? Yes. And actually, I was Googling it, and it turns out it's not that uncommon. There are support groups out there for people like me who are addicted to love. And there's a meeting tonight, and I need you to come with me. Free pizza? Free pizza. <laughs> Alright, I'll go with you. At least it'll be dinner and a show. Dude, look at these sad saps. Guaranteed if someone started playing John Mayer, this guy starts savagely masturbating in the middle of the room. Look, just go get your fucking pizza. Hi, I'm Matt. Hey, I'm Steve. Hi, I'm Paul. Hi, I'm Doug. And I'm a romantic. I've been one for as long as I can remember. I know guys that'll see a girl on TV and then just start talking about how they, you know, tap that ass or do these aggressive, possibly illegal things to her tits. And I'll look at her and I'll think, God, I would give my left nut just to be able to chase her down at the airport. You know, before she goes to her new job in Japan. Who is she to say we should skip Valentine's Day? I paid the marching band in advance to play her favorite song in the park. She just wanted to stay in and have sex. And that's when I realized I was totally Team Jacob. Uh, hi. Um, this is my first time being here, and, uh, actually, I'm not even sure I should be doing this. Yeah, you know what, definitely fuck this. I'm going back to pounding natties and fucking bitches. Thanks. Oh! Oh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't think there'd be anybody else out here right now. Wait, are you in that club? What? The, no. No, me? No, I'm not in that Oh. Club. Just because girls on campus love guys in Romantics Anonymous. It's so sweet that there are nice guys in college. Really? Um, well, I, I mean, I'm not not in that club. What? Uh, yes, yes, I'm, I'm in that club. It's just been really nice to um, be able to get my emotions out and meet new people. So, then where are you going? I just came out to get my uh, jacket, which is on me, so I'm gonna go back in now, actually. It was nice meeting you, though. And that's when I started rubbing chocolate sauce all over my body. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. Uh, hi. My name is Sam, and I'm a romantic. And there's nothing wrong with that. And you know what? There's nothing wrong with us, either. And I don't think we need a support group just because we love our girlfriends enough to want to show the whole world. Yeah. And enough to want to make them feel special every day. Yes! And enough to save little locks of their hair and keep them under our pillow so we can smell them while we sleep. Yes! But I'm um, getting carried away. The point is, the world is changing. There's a place for us romantics, and it's high time that everybody else came to accept that. Thank you. Woo! I saw your speech. It was definitely spirited. Oh, well, thanks. You know, I was just speaking from the heart. I love that. Oh, 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 oh,